It's another day of sunshine and showers. Yet again, it's mild, but the outlook turns cooler. I'll have all the details of that and more coming up. Good morning, Britain. First. For me and for my daughter, so I'm going to show you. Oh, thanks. Come on. <laughs> um, so you know how I love my climate stripes. This is a simplified version of the climate stripes from Ed Hawkins from the University of Reading. Every single line represents the temperature on Earth compared to average. So the blue is back at the Industrial Revolution when it was cooler than average. And slowly but surely, as we move through to present day right now, this is my mum, uh, present day, to see how the world has warmed rapidly. The last 10 years have been the warmest 10 years on record. This is the world that my mum lives in right now. By nearly 2050, this is the world that I would live in. And by nearly 2100, this represents Charlotte. So we have different futures. Good morning. Now, weather-wise, much like it was yesterday, it is a day of sunshine and showers. Some of them heavy, some of them thundery. And yet again, it's windy and mild. Here's the details, though. Here's how it looks first thing this morning. Showers fairly heavy for the northwest. Good morning to you. We have pretty mixed weather as we head through the next few days, so let's roll on with the details. Low pressure is close by. Low pressure means we're often set to see wet and windy conditions. Follow the isobars back, the lines, they go down towards the mid-Atlantic, and that means 16, maybe 17, yet again, it's mild. So let's see how things change as we head through the next seven days. We keep the southwesterly flow, we keep the mild feed of air, but let's start with the north of the UK. Scotland, Northern Ireland, northern areas of England, average temperatures here, it turns a little cooler as we head through the end of the week and in the weekend, but milder into next week. Percentage chance of rainfall, how likely to see wet weather across the north of the UK over the next seven days. Today, hit and miss with showers. Likely to see more frequent showers as we head towards the end of the week and the start of the weekend. But Sunday and Monday look like they're set to be driest in the north. Fortunes further south for England and Wales for the next seven days. Temperatures remain above average throughout most of the period, actually. Just a little blip as we head through to Monday, but mild by day and by night. Percentage a chance of rainfall across the south. How likely we are to see wet weather? Well, at the moment, it's hit and miss showers, heavy showers, maybe rain on Sunday, but looking driest on Monday. Good morning to you. We continue our weather pretty much as it was yesterday. Sunshine and showers is the summary. A little more detail, though, is coming. First thing this morning, we have got more organised showers, heavy ones through northern areas of England. Hit and miss across Wales. And first thing, we have some rain. Welcome back to Good Morning Britain. Spring certainly feels like it's in the air at the moment and with the sunshine, those temperatures are way above average. And that's because the wind and the air at the moment is coming from the southwest, from the mid-Atlantic, drawing up this moisture. But it also brings with it the... Morning to you. Now, today's weather, much like yesterday, it is one of sunshine and showers. Some of them could be heavy, but they'll be fairly few and far between. First thing this morning, greeted by some wet weather in the form of showers through Wales, northern areas of England and the north of Scotland, but many of us starting off fine and dry. As we head through the day, it won't be long before the showers arrive, but they're very hit and miss. So coming through, sunny one second, showers come through, and then more prolonged sunshine afterwards. When they occur, though, particularly Northern Ireland, Northern England, they could be heavy with the odd rumble of thunder and fairly blustery as well. A mild day ahead, highs of 16 or 17 degrees, but turning cloudy and wet in the far south later. A miserable damp end to the day here.